I'm Melanie Anderson, and today I'm going to teach you the occupation of cooking in IADL according to the Occupational Therapy Practice Framework. I chose to teach you this occupation not only because cooking is something that I like to do, but it's something that our patients will want to do throughout their lives. First, I will make lasagna the traditional way. Steps that we will follow. Heat the oven to 350. Boil water and add the noodles. We're going to add two cups of ricotta. Two cups of mozzarella, a little bit of parsley, and two eggs. Really? After you have boiled and drained your noodles, you need a pan for your lasagna. And just put a little layer of sauce on the bottom. Spread the sauce. And then layer four noodles along the bottom. Turn it off. This is hot. <laughs> you layer your four noodles. Take your mozzarella and ricotta and spread it evenly across. After you have spread that evenly, add another layer of sauce and another layer of noodles and repeat until your tray is full. Put it in the oven for 30 minutes. For 30 minutes, your lasagna is complete. Based on my observations at the assisted living, I saw many patients with Alzheimer's and dementia. If you have Alzheimer's or dementia, an alternative way to make lasagna would be to make a frozen lasagna. It does not involve using a flame or the oven. assisted living, I saw many people who had eye problems. One way to modify this activity would be to make the steps to make lasagna bigger so it's easier to see if you have eye problems. <laughs> Making lasagna would be to add more steps, such as mixing and pouring. This would work on motor skills and coordination. <laughs> 